Hello and welcome. My name is Arunli and you are watching Tube Mint. In this video, we are going to have a look at a Shopify premium theme called Woodwork. So go ahead and log into your Shopify admin and visit the theme store. Or if you already have this theme installed and you would like to quickly understand how it works and what are the features or if you're planning to buy this woodstock theme this video is going to be helpful all right so what i'm going to do i'm going to try this theme first so I'm going to install it on my store and once it is added to the store we will quickly have a look at the uh, demo store that this theme offers okay so what i'm going to do i'm going to let it be added on my store you can see it's trying to add we are going to check the demo store of this woodstock theme so go ahead and click it go view demo store all right so it's just trying to install just add it so i'm going to close this tab okay we will only look at the uh, demo store first and then i'll move back to the customizer so this is a default light style that you have the other one is dark okay so there are two styles pre-made presets of this theme slightly this compare feature that you get and this is uh, cart and you got the account you can add your phone and and then if you've got multiple uh, stores in multiple cities right multiple uh, contact centers you can list them there all right now this is awesome quick stylish uh, slider that you see with animation on it this is collection minimalist collection but it looks okay then you got the products okay we will check if we okay so there is add to cart button as you hover on this product okay right try and then you got this another section i think it's a collections section we will have a look and this also seems to be collections a single this is featured collection this is collection list i guess the featured connect collection with style variant and then this is very common one services and fe features woodwork news this is from blog FQ uh, sections okay very much the same thing with a different style okay and so we'll switch to uh, the mobile theme so i forgot to check the menu okay so they got both mega menu and simple menu so go back and you'll see okay so it looks okay it's coming from the right there is something in it This is the header that has been customized to your mobile and uh, smartphones. Single view. Okay, let, let's switch over to the dark theme style. Okay, so almost the same thing, which is the dark. So it had it would have been better if you have given a chance let's let's a uh, uh, mode style mode switcher dark and light just a button on the top so that would have been uh good for the visitors i guess okay so this is how it looks uh before we move on to anything else so you got everything the same in the both styles it's just the background color the mode dark and light 
this is your catalog page we will check the hmm. check the products page and this is how it looks suggestion product suggestion View. right so looks the same that's the most important page here in services we will check the contact page this is what you have fine watchmaking okay this is a page all right so that's your custom page all right so that's it for the demo what i'm going to do i'll go back to my customizer the team has been already added so this is good stuff demo and the demo store looks okay it's, it has all the same feature that um maybe the dawn has but it is a bit customized okay so let's quickly go ahead and check the woodwork in the customizer okay this is how it looks with the defaults uh, okay slightly different right this seems to be um let me call it um, some css framework powered theme like like bootstrap or something like that okay so this is how it is let's check what we have in the sections the video section as well so collapsible content blog post featured collection of image gallery Featured collection, featured collection, slide show. You can add the announcement bar, banner grid, before, after image, uh, slider. Okay, so this can go into header group, which is awesome. You can put your production collections in there. All right. Okay. This is, how, this is how it looks on the mobile we will check the settings so colors obviously obviously it's more like the same all the stylus uh, what I'm going to do I'm going to change the template to product and this is how it looks one thing I felt it it's it's loading a bit quicker faster so Could be the reason that I do not have. Oh, there are so many. This is coming from. Hmm. So. Okay. All right. So. Yeah. So obviously, you can change the color. Okay. What do you have here? Okay, so mm, color you can customize once you purchase the theme you should have the dark and light colors. What I'm gonna do I'm going to preview the store instead of customizing because the customizer is almost the same. So this is how it looks. It looks clean, right? You can obviously add the mega menu. Okay, indoor. Hmm. Okay, this is how the. Hmm. 
free shipping these are thousand at thousand dollars this is recommendations in the art drawer okay so it quickly opens the drawer let me check one more so this is how the variant shows in in here view the card if you go to view the card it takes you to the card page i think this is not uh, right that is when you're on the card page you should not recommend anything you just want them to quickly check out right you don't want to have something on the card being on the product page it is okay to recommend similar product but not on the card page that's not a good practice alrighty so okay although this is this is not very good experience once you've added something to the card and somebody wants to look at your product you don't want to remind here rather it's already there um you want to keep something right on the top if you want to remind that you need just this much to get a free or something here on the right top or need something to be you can add this much to get a free delivery you just don't want to yeah you don't want to let your customer be sort of um, interrupted while looking at the other, other products right so let's check it check the blocks section here and this is obviously not customized this is default one all right so this is your woodstock game with a twist to its look and feel and a few custom blocks all right and this costs you 280 dollars so looks okay that's what we have here so i want to add the oh, what i want to add the let me check so it takes me to the product i want to change this to home page and let's see what we have in the announcement bar everyone wants to have announcement bar so announcement bar is below okay and you got something here okay so i'm going to see that let's check in the footer this is also really oh, i don't understand this what is below the footer oh, yes. i think this is okay theme a generic theme which you can use uh, on multi many many stores many niches in many niches so if you have any questions question leave in the comment if you need support help with any theme customization you can always get in touch with me at this email thank you for watching right now